Society's standards are calibrated outside the family and these roles have a great impact on them. Here's what you need to know. Integrity has to be built in the family, but the family unit is not the only one responsible for the state of our society. We know the bad side of parental failure. Let me share with you a short story to cement this idea even more and then let's talk about what needs to happen so that the world we live in changes course for the better. A friend of mine told me of an event that is simply appalling. His son, in his English class in high school, turned in a paper on the justice system and received the highest grade. Just when I was about to congratulate him, he told me that he actually wrote the paper for his son because he was falling behind. As proud as my friend was, the only thing I could say was what chance does your son have if he will learn to always find someone to do his work for him? What is the future of our society if we teach the young children of today that cheating and fraud are okay? This is a very disappointing story, friend, since that young boy will be robbed of the harsh lessons of accountability and his father has abdicated his leadership responsibilities as a parent and citizen. As his son learned that cheating is okay in order to win, some other child was denied the recognition for having the best paper. Instead of holding his son accountable, this selfish father is passing along the dishonesty that is eating away our society and his son is enabled to betray his responsibility to learn and perform. As clear as the conclusion of this story might be, friend, there are other roles in society besides the role of a parent that have just as much influence when it comes to standards of behavior. If we take the example shared in our story, an educator, one whom might have been involved in the paper fraud from before, has a special and unique opportunity to help and rebuild our society. If an educator takes his role seriously, he will understand the responsibility he has been charged with and he will have available a great platform to communicate powerful ideas, both about his designated subject and about other subjects that are appropriate in discussions with children and teenagers. He can help build a better world, first by executing his responsibilities well and always being prepared, organized and skilled in his presentation. Second, approachable teachers are always viewed by their students as a third party to whom they can go for advice and at least in primary and secondary schools, educators stand in place of the parents and have the great opportunity to impact the lives of their pupils beyond the classroom. Show support, friend, for educators that put a great effort in enabling learning for all those who seek to grow their minds. Educators that encourage thinking as an individual grounded in socially responsible values. Educators that have the ability to teach both with their actions and their domain-specific skills. Corporate scandals have had their negative effect in our society, generating anxiety and doubt among the public with the constant allegations and prosecutions of those accused of misconducts. If we are honest, friend, a portion of the taxes we all pay is set aside to protect the public from harm globally and domestically, yet many countries in the West leave questions unanswered and leaders of great corporations as well as political parties seem to be free to engage in unethical behavior with questionable intentions without the fear of repercussions. At this point, when confidence in the effectiveness of government systems is shaken, people are losing hope and their desire to participate in democratic societies shrinks and this is a very dangerous path. When partisan politics replaces commitment to the common good, when integrity-centered governmental leadership is compromised, our free market democracy is at risk. Employees of the government hold positions of public trust by supporting the common good. When these roles are performed efficiently and effectively, there is no greater calling than public service. Applaud and endorse, friend, government officials that go the extra mile when necessary to offer support in hard times, 
leaders who own the defeats and failures of their policies and who pass along to others the credit for victories, the ones willing to regulate destructive and self-serving greed, reminding us all that a free market system and the democracy that we often take for granted can only thrive if we all can balance properly legitimate self-interest and social responsibility. We can all agree that celebrities and popular public figures are not role models for our youth. The parents need to be that. But as the young children become aware of the world outside of the family, particularly in adolescence, their environment becomes increasingly important and they learn from their peers, from their heroes, from celebrities. Since adolescents wish to belong and crave the approval of their peers, they will have a strong tendency to identify with those individuals in society who have achieved celebrity status, and the attention their celebrity generates transforms these public figures into the role models who will be imitated. It is our responsibility, friend, to praise celebrities and public figures, singers, athletes, movie stars, powerful individuals who model admirable behavior, who embrace appreciation, as well as humility and self-discipline. Children watch star athletes perform and admire their talent, skill, as well as their behavior outside the sport. Fans observe what their heroes do away from their particular area of expertise and have a strong desire to emulate their actions. If we wish to rebuild our Western society on a strong and stable foundation, it is our duty to keep accountable teachers, public officials and celebrities, and to applaud only the ones that uphold the highest standards of behavior. And if you are part of one of these categories, friend, know that your actions play a great role in the state of our society, and you have a great duty and opportunity to shape this world for the better. Your praise and admiration, your vote, the money that you spend and the voice that you have, have the potential to support integrity-centered behavior. There to put all these resources to good use, so that the world of tomorrow will be better than the one of today. Your choices will impact not only you, 